What's up, YouTube? Uh, it's your boy, Trail James. And um, I just want to share with y'all a Judgment Day vision that I have. Um, I need to start putting dates on these because I really don't be putting uh, the dates on them. Um, I got some dreams uh, like, like recorded and some, you know, visions uh, uh, that's recorded, but out of, out of like majority of them, well, some of them I don't have, you know, recorded, but I remember them. So this, th this, you know, Judgment Day vision that I had, it was where um, we was, it was like millions of, upon trillions. I, I could not even give you a number. There were so many people standing before God and, and it was judgment day. Like I remember in that setting, um, we, we couldn't run away. We couldn't do any of that. Our bodies, it, it obeyed the very fact that God's presence was there. And I remember just, um, uh, there were lines. I'm talking about, man, if, if there were lines of people, lines. I'm talking about, it had to be, you know, thousands of lines. But, you know, like I said, it was millions upon billions upon trillions of people. It was a lot of people that was, you know, getting judged, that was, you know, getting ready to be judged. And although I did not hear God judging somebody, the only thing that I saw was that each of these lines were were going up quick. They like God was like uh, like God was judging these people, and and wherever they went, or, or that's where they went. Uh, they was getting judged like that, and and the lines was going up. And in that dream, I remember I was like. If I can give you, man, if I can give you an estimate or something, uh, I was like the 400 and something uh, uh, millionth person or something in line. It, it was so many people. I, I could not really tell you. It was, it was hard to, it's hard to describe it because like there's not a number in my head I can you know think of that can compare to to what you know order that that I was in, cause all I know it had to be in the you know millions billions or something. But as as everybody was standing in line, you know, getting ready to be judged by God, like it um nobody couldn't run nowhere. Like you couldn't run and leave and take a bathroom break. You couldn't do none of that. When you was before God, you was before God getting ready to be judged. And, and the one thing I noticed about judgment day, you know, um, was nobody was talking to the person that was, you know, behind them, in front of them, on the, you know, sides. Nobody was talking to anybody. The only thing, like, everybody was just looking straight ahead. Because God's presence was so strong. Like, like, everybody's presence was just looking straight ahead. Like, nobody could even escape. Nobody. And, and um, so, I just want to, you know, share this Judgment Day vision that I had. And... And, um, and I can't wait to tell y'all about, you know, the other experiences that I had. And I, but I just want to encourage y'all to, you know, every day uh, live as best as you can for, for God. And if you are not saved and you want to know Jesus, simply just ask him to come into your life and save you. It's not hard. It's, it's simple, but you have to come from a willing heart and you, and you ha have to want to be, you know, saved by God, by Jesus. 
So, but for every believer in Christ, I encourage I encourage y'all to keep on, you know, uh, 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 living for God. I know at times it gets hard and we fall into sin, but get back up. You know, um, you know, God called us at, at, as his children. And so we are to, you know, display Christ every day and, and truly give our, our life to him. So y'all just stay encouraged and I love y'all and be safe out there. All right, bye.